Hey everyone, so it's been a bit, it's been a few months or a couple months since I've filmed a YouTube video. Um, I did post frequently and um, a couple of flips of my planner on my Instagram, but I figured this is a little bit easier to walk through and tell you where things are from and kind of keep it all in one, one video versus a million clips on like Insta stories. So it's probably going to be lengthy and chatty and I'm going to show you a few other things and I have a couple of my other planners to show you guys and I can tell you the differences that I've noticed um, because I do have three of these in different colors. This is the Spice Personal Rings. These now come in wide and I've been using these since, I don't know, like the beginning of December? Maybe? I can't remember. It's on my Instagram. I can't remember. Um, but I started with my saffron. It is so amazing. You guys, I, I'll just start with the differences of the leather real quick. Um, this is turmeric. It has a very different smell. I, should, I shouldn't say smell. Scent. Whatever. Because it doesn't stink. It just is a very different smelling leather than this one, which is saffron. This saffron, I could smell this planner all day long. It smells so good and it's so like rustic looking and it's squishy and I just, I'm obsessed with this one. Um, so it's not picking up true to color. It's more of like an orangey color. Right now it's picking up really reddish, I guess. Um, and then this is pepper. And pepper really doesn't have a smell at all. And it's very, very smooth and not a lot going on. Um, and it's just very classy and I like it. It's very classic. I wish now that I had gotten the bow on it instead of the moon, but that's okay. It's not the end of the world. And then my turmeric. My turmeric is the smoothest of the three. Um, and yeah, and I did the blind embossed bow and it is really, really stuffed. This is by far, Mommy. hold on one, sorry you guys, I have no idea what I said in my last clip, but anyway, this is by far my most favorite planner. Like I am obsessed with everything about it. I love that it can be so stuffed full of everything you love because let's face it, planners are personal and I like little cuteness to make me open my planner and flip through it and I love that this planner allows me to do that. Um, I've used Filofaxes, I've used the original Foxy Rings, I've used Gilios, and let's face it, if I had a strap, I would not be able to close this whatsoever. Um, but, so I kind of have the best of both worlds. I have a ring bound planner, but with a TN elastic that allows me to stuff this thing. Now I did text Kelly this morning telling her I could go for some 50 millimeter rings because I have a funny story last night. I was setting this planner up with the new Planner Society kit and I had so much stuff in this planner that I didn't want to part with that when I closed the, closed the binder, put the elastic around, I heard a pop noise. <laughs> My rings popped open on their own because I had so much stuff in this. I almost swore right there. Anyway, I had so much stuff in this planner. But anyway, I think I finally have it exactly how I need it. Um, I, I feel like this binder in particular, um, no matter what color I use, this is the binder that I'm going to be sticking with. Um, I am definitely getting a couple of other colors in this binder. And my inserts, my inserts are going to kind of fluctuate. I am sure I'm not alone in this. We try inserts, insert companies come out with different inserts and you're like, oh, I could definitely use that and change this up, whatever. So I definitely change my inserts frequently. Um, just to try new things and figure out what's going to work and what doesn't work. And, um, but anyway, so enough of that. I feel like I finally have my inserts to where they need to be and what I need to keep in my planner. So without further ado, I usually keep my highlighter in here, but I decided to add an extra pen loop because let's face it, I was getting, I was getting a little pissed every time I tried to take my highlighter out of there and it wouldn't come out. And it's because I have a lot of stuff in here. So yes, it is definitely bulky, um, but I'm okay with that. I love everything. And I have just a few little bits and pieces in here. I don't feel like my front pockets and everything are too overdone. 
Um, these little girls are hand-drawn little doodles from Kimmy Plans. She's on Instagram. It is extremely hard to get a slot, so you definitely need to follow her um, if you want to try and get one. And then I have my little Grin and Barrett sampler. I just have... I don't know, just some other random stuff in there. Oh, this is like my little Fox and Pip thing. That's where that went. Create with pen. I could not find that Fox and Pip die cut and now I know where it is. My little pigtails and, there's a hair on there. Pigtails and pocket clip. And then my dividers, I kept them pretty basic. I didn't do anything too, whoops. Didn't do anything too crazy with them. Sorry, there's a glare. Um, my bows are from the planner press. Um, hold on. I think I have a set to show you. Mine are the blush pink and then it comes with these little labels here, but she also has them in this color and they're, this, these are rose gold foiled. Um, so I really like Violet is snoring, you guys. She is on the couch next to me and she is snoring really, really loud. Um, so I'm sorry if you hear her. Um, but anyway, so instead of using the Planner Society tabs, I used Planner Press tabs, and I do have a coupon code. Um, I think it's iHeart to Plan 20. I think that's what it is. Uh, just if you want to snag some of these. And then I do leave my little, these little embellishments hanging over a little bit. I don't know. Just, I don't really love the way the backside looks, but I love the way the front looks. And then I have, this is from Kelsey Plans. And then Fox and Pip, this was a digital. I don't even care that that's val from Valentine's. I just love it. And then Princesa Plans, that um, was sent in happy mail to me. And then my little Grin and Barrett heart. And then I have some vellum, vel nope. I think right now all the vellum and acetate is from Planner Society and Planner Press. And then these are my top dividers. I have them for each of my kiddos, uh, Remy Lila, or Ryan Lila, Remy Violet. Don't ask me, I can never get my kids' names straight. Uh, those are from Martha Plans. She is also on Instagram. And then these, I got this idea from my girlfriend, Lindsay. Um, I have those little pockets from Erin Condren and I just slip their future appointment cards in the front there. And I am gonna flip through my kids' section and the only reason I'm flipping through my kids section is because I took all of my inserts that I had in, I took them out and I put fresh ones in because I had a lot of information from like two years ago on these pages and I did not, I just don't need that anymore. So I printed some fresh inserts. I'm about to tell you how I use each of them. Um, so that's just blank in the inside, but these are from Sweet Caress. Sweet Caress, I'm gonna, I will link her. Um, Sweet Caress, these are just a today page. And basically what I'm using these for um, is at random. It doesn't have to be every day. Um, I definitely plan to track my kids' moods. Um, I was doing it. I took that, I took last month's out, this past month's out, I should say. And so I'm starting fresh and I basically would just write, it's the first and Ryan had a great day or Ryan did this or that. Um, just so like I have reference or Ryan seemed to be down, he wasn't feeling good. And then two days later he's sick or things like that. Just so I can kind of gauge things about my kids. This I'm going to skip over cause that was just, um, a health thing. He had an appointment and then this is his school schedule that I have stuck in there. This is by so much crafting. This is just, if he has a doctor's appointment, I put the reason for the visit and the date. Um, this is from Annie Plans. This is a tip-in off of her health tracker. And basically I just track if my kids have a temperature. And then I just print random covers. So my covers are from Annie Plans. I don't know what particular, oh, it, I do. This is the lesson planning uh, cover. Um, and I just printed it. And then the next one is Lila and her setup is exactly the same. I have a place to track how she's doing that day. I have her health tracker. I have her school schedule. I have, um, yeah, I have her so much crafting inserts. So this, I'm actually using any plans for Ryan, but I'm using so much crafting for Lila and I just track again, fevers or anything. 
And then it's the same thing, you guys, for Remy. Um, he doesn't have a future appointment yet because he just had his. And then my little Miss Violet, she has her future appointment. Um, I wrote, I typed these out in Word, cut them out, and then sticker rollered them onto the cover. I do not know how to print my wording on my covers. I need to make one for me. So in here, just again, I have my own health tracker, health log, um, and appointments. And then these, I've talked about them many times. These are from Filofax. Um, you can get these in a two pack. They are very bendable. Um, they are already pre-slit for you to put into your planner. And I just clip those in. And then these little, I got them on Amazon if I didn't just say that. And then my post-it notes um, are all random. I have some from Sparkly Paper Co. I have some from Fox and Pip. Um, my newest addiction, these are planner press. And then like I was saying, these are from Shell's Scribbles. She is also on Instagram. My next section is where I spend most of my time. This is my fitness section. Um, Carolyn just tagged me in something. <laughs> Sorry, I'm getting notifications on my phone and it's distracting. Um, anyway, so this is my fitness section. I'm actually pretty proud of myself. I am not, like, I'm just not a huge workout person. Um, I, just, I mean, I, I want to stay fit. I, I feel like I'm pretty fit. I chase my kids 24-7. Um, but I really wanted to do something for myself. And I take 30 minutes out of my day to either use my elliptical, my bike, or my Bowflex. And just, it feels great. And I do it right at home. I don't... I don't watch DVDs or do any of those kind of things because I never stick with that sort of thing. I'm really liking the bike and the elliptical because I can just watch YouTube videos and it distracts me and my workout is over before I know it. Um, so anyway, I spend a lot of time in this section. Uh, this was a, I think Annie has this now posted in her Instagram or in her Facebook group. It is just a hello today that I just laminated and then I have just some little cute bits and pieces back here. This is from Banana Doodle, Willa Wallaco, Van Sticky. And I'm drawing a blank. Someone super sweet gave this to me on Instagram. Oh, I'm drawing a blank on her name. Um, this is from Ashy Lee. And then again, I just kind of mismoshed, mix mosh, whatever. You know what I'm saying. I mixed and matched inserts together. I can't speak today. And I made my mood tracker and I made my step tracker. And this is a free printable in Annie's group. This is part of her list insert. The cover is from her um, academic or the lesson planner thing. And I just went pretty basic with my moods. Happy, average, stressed, sad, tired, or it's just a blah day altogether. Um, I think for the most part, I'm a pretty happy person and it takes a lot to, to bring me down, but I feel like I'm really liking how this is working out. I have to say, I'm not really liking the color that I chose for tired. It just looks crappy <laughs> with my other colors. Um, these are from Spring Tree Design. Um, Basically, I'm just, anytime I'm in a blah mood, sad mood, stress mood, I just note on that date what caused me to be in that mood. Um, I think I might turn that into a kind of gratitude thing. And then my steps, I wear a Fitbit Blaze. So I have not updated my steps with the highlighting, but it's all on my phone. Um, and then I kind of made like a little vision board. Let's all pray that Violet does not wake up in the middle of this video. Um, so I made a little vision board. I'm obsessed with Kate Hudson. She is, oh, I just love her. And I love Lindsay Price. She is just, she's freaking gorgeous and an amazing mom. Um, and then these, I just found them online. Um, just like little self-care things, different challenges. Um, this little yoga challenges. My kids do this with me. It's pretty funny. A little plank challenge. This is hard. Really, really hard. I am just not good at planking. Um, then a couple other things. This bow vellum is from, I think, Banana Doodle. Bananas, Banana Doodle, I think. And then this is from Banana Doodle. I just love this little thing. And this is where I am doing my meals, my workouts. Uh, yeah, my meals and my workouts. 
So this is an Annie Plans insert. I believe it was a collab with Two Little Bees, Maria. And I back planned a couple of weeks and then this is where I really started using it. I put my workouts, I put my grocery shopping list, I put our meals for the week. Oh my God, this is already 12 minutes. Um, actually longer because I filmed on that last clip. All right, anyway, so I'm making it even longer. So then this was not, yeah, that was the week before. There's our grocery shopping, meals. And then this was this this was last week, my workouts. I did not work out on Saturday. Um, and then again, our meals. And then I've pretty much slacked off on my grocery shopping list, which I am making today. And then our meal plan. My husband's been gone for a few days, so. Um, anyway, so I worked out yesterday, I worked out today. And then all these post-its are not usually here, but I'm covering a bunch of people's addresses. Um, I started a bunch of like uh, fitness challenges through the Fitbit, basically just step challenges, not fitness challenges. Um, and I have three solid groups going on right now and I have a fourth that I'm starting. And we basically just keep each other motivated and I just don't wanna share any of their emails. Okay, and then I printed this from Peanuts Planner Co. This is a workout tracker and I was gonna give this a shot but I'm not sure how I wanna use it yet. So it's just, it's kind of in there. And then my babies. And I'm obsessed with these once more with love stickies. And then this gorgeous bow vellum is from uh, my girlfriend Savannah at Planner Press. I have like four sheets of it in here. These are so freaking cute. These little puffy pom-poms. I have some also from um, Lamb, Peony's Papery. And I just love them. I think they're so cute. And I just love them jingling off my planner. Uh, so this is my monthly section. This video is going to be like 30 minutes. My monthly section. My little babies wrote that. I think Lila wrote that. This is from Megan from Grumpy Bear. My um, dividers that look like this are from Plan and Glam XO. Kayla, she made these for me. Um, oh. I forgot to put my stuff back in this folder. This is from Jen's Crafty Design. It's just a little folder with a scalloped edge. And then my little pen loops are from Erin Condren. I got them at Staples. This pullout has our vacations on it. This is so much crafting. Birthdays, birthdays, oh, school schedule, birthdays. This is from Fox and Pip. And then my monthlies. So I actually decided to reprint my monthlies I wasn't loving the way that they looked. I know that sounds really silly, but um, yeah. So I changed them up. So they're blank right now, and I'm going to rewrite my stuff in there today. Here's another one of those um, Filofax things, and I just love how they clip in and out. So I need to rewrite my monthlies today, priority. And then my tabs are all from Planner Press. You can get these foiled in rose and in gold, I believe. And then I pre-plan on Post-Its. And then these, I decided not to have like a, a full on bill section because it's just, I don't have a ton of bills. Um, so I just printed this little pocket thing and I'm just gonna write our bills on there. And then on this planner, these are both Peanuts Planner Co. And this one, I'm just gonna put our bills that only occur yearly, like once a year. Yeah, honey. Okay, so this is my today section. And I just have some cuteness in here, Sparkly Paper Co. This little frame, I believe, was from Coffee Monster Co. It's either Coffee Monster Co. or it was Van Sticky. Uh, this is Simply Gilded, um, Shine Sticker Studio. And these were um, Banana Doodle. And then I just have some pretty stickers. These are Shell Scribbles. I got rid of my inbox section. Like, I was using a full huge insert not huge it was pages a few pages um and I took it out and went right back to a post-it these are this is crap I need to get done today and I am in love with these bookmarks you don't even have to laminate them these are from planner society um <laughs> this one I love of Ashley from Spark. well hold on I have text messages up on my phone right now or up on my watch right now um anyway so this is from sparkly paper code this is Ashley eating her Cheetos and she always gets upset that she can't eat her Cheetos when she makes her stickers um this is a list insert from Annie however I'm not using the inside of the insert I just took the cover 
And this is how I daily plan now. I'm using the Sweet Caress Today pages, and I literally make a list of things that I need to do, highlight them as I do them, and then same with this. Everything I complete is highlighted. Things that are not complete are not highlighted. As you can see, I still have a bunch of stuff I need to get done. This is a little page marker that I made, me and my hubby. And then this is from Brandy. And another one of those little pom-poms. And then I love this little bear. This was from um, Sparkly Paper Co. as well. And so I have a bunch of pages in here so I can keep going with that. So that is my daily planning. I'm not using any other particular insert. I have a to buy section. And then this is where I track, oh, my phone's gonna die. Of course it is. Um, and then this is where I track uh, my kids' stars. So like brushing their teeth, picking up their room. Um, if they do certain things to help me around the house without asking, uh, sleeping in their room all night, those kind of things. So I have a, a star chart for each of them. And basically the stars just add up and they can, they can pick a gift or whatever if we go to like Walmart, a little treat, whatever. Um, I'm not gonna lie, I'm a sucker and I buy my kids stuff. Oh well, that's what I do. Uh, this is a little card from Barry, not from Barry, from Grin and Barrett. Oh, I need to go back to bed. Uh, uh, Amanda from Fox and Pip made this beautiful little doodle for me. And I think it's so funny that my husband has his beard in this picture. Um, this, I don't know if you guys can see it. That again was like a little foiled bear from Sparkly Paper Co. Peony's Papery. Um, this, I saw this, I think it was on Little Miss Alaska's, um, Instagram. And I loved it. So I had to print it. Me and my honey. This was from... It was a big collab between a few girls. I think this one is Sparkly Paper Co. or it's Fox and Pip. I can't remember. Um, you would think I would know this. They are my girlfriends. And then this is my weekly. Again, I just cut out. I'm sure you can see it's like total DIY, but who cares? Uh, I went back to using these. And I just started using them two weeks ago. Um, this is Annie's week. Um, excuse me, week per page. And I have... The entire year in here um, so basically it's just all of my important things that I need to see at a glance yes those are going to be on my monthly but I like to see them at a weekly view as well this is just in here I need to take that out and write this somewhere else and then this was last week this is this week and then like I said I have the whole year this again I just like having pretty post-its in my planner this is where I keep my son's like spelling words and I have just some cute little die cuts in here. And I love this little heart thing. Um, picture of my, my little family. Sorry guys, this is really long. Lila wrote me a note to not forget her money and I thought it was cute so I left it in there. And then I'm obsessed with this little unicorn from Shine Sticker Studio. This is like my routine. It's, I don't always stick to this. It's not, it's just something that I kind of mess around with. But basically just my wake up, let, feeding the dog, letting him out, making lunches, drinking my water, checking my planner, work, and then working out. Daily, I like to update my notes, declutter space, work out, drink my water. Love the, I wrote love those baby and hubby. I don't know what I was thinking. Anyway. I love them all day long anyway. And then evening routine is just a 15 minute pickup. I, I cannot, I cannot go to bed without picking up my house. I just, it makes me crazy to wake up in the morning and it be mass chaos. Um, plan the next day, pack my kids bags and then read to my littles. Um, so we read it. I try to read a book at night to them. Lately, they've been wanting me to do dinosaurs on the wall. Basically, I just put a a flashlight on my stomach and they look up at the wall and I do like this little da, 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 whatever dinosaurs uh, this is my daily kind of checklist of what I do in my planner and then I this is a vinyl sticker that I stuck it down on the paper like I'm never gonna be able to part with this piece of paper um, so this is just my note section so I literally took out all of my random um, mix matched papers that I had in here and I'm going to rewrite the notes that I really really want in here get it done I use around my house um for things that I want to do around our house 
Violet do that for me. There's another one from Kimmy Plans. So this is my, it says budget, but I don't, I don't it's not really a budget. It's just my, my finance section. Um, Ashley made this for me, a little pocket from Planner Society. And then I've got that from, <laughs> from Princess of Plans. Um, and, oh no, did I get this from Prince? Oh, this was like a collab between Princesa Plans and, um, Planners Monkey Co. And then, anyway, so finance. He was star student of the month, so I put that in there. Uh, Grin and Barrett. And then this was from, uh, Shell Scribbles. And I just have my passwords. I have my checkbook register. And that is it. I don't... As far as tracking like online orders and all that stuff, I had that in here and I never touch it. So with that being said, if I order stuff, I'll just stick it on a post-it. Then this is kind of like my miscellaneous back here. I have addresses. I have this from Willa Wallaco and just more like little things about my babies or my family, not my babies. I guess they're my babies. Anyway, so this is just random stuff back here, like um, things that I want to try. Uh, these are campsites that I want to look into. And then this was Christmas cards, and these were Christmas gift ideas that I had gotten my kids and family, and I just want it for reference. And then this, I stuck this bow on the back here, and I had to put... Room is playing. Anyway, so I had to put packing tape over it because... Look what it was doing to my, my planner. It was scratching it. Um, anyway, so I just have some random cute little bits in here. Grumpy Bear. Um, this little thing from Amanda Fox and Pip. Shine Sticker Studio. And then this. This is from the Planner Society kit. And I just have some Banana Doodle stickers in there. Um, and then in the... You all right there, Rumi? Oh, he's Darth Vader, you guys. He's got a scary mask on. And then back here, I just have some random little things and pictures that my kids make me. Um, but you guys, I've, I honestly, I know that I've said this in the past. I mean, hello. Um, but I'm so content. Like, I feel like this is working for me. I think if anything, the only thing that I'm misusing right now is I have so many cool, fun stickers. Um, but... It's not to the point where I want to switch this up. Like, this is working. I have my daily pages that I just have to cross things off with. It's super easy. If I don't finish it, I don't have to move it to another day. I just have to flip my pages till I highlight it off. Um, and then I have my weekly view, my monthly view. But I really feel like I've got a good system going on right now. Um, anyway. I've been trying to figure out how I want to go about posting this. I think I'm just going to post it. But I'm not sure if I want to direct you to ask me questions on my Instagram or whatever. I'll leave comments on here. I'll leave comments on this video and I will try my damnedest to answer all of them in a timely manner. Um, and yeah, so hang tight. If I don't answer your question, um, please don't think I've completely forgotten about you. I definitely will get back to you as soon as I can. But this is fun. I really enjoyed doing this video. I had spent a long time since I've sat down and talked for this long about my planner. So hopefully it wasn't too long, too boring, and hopefully you guys got some um, some ideas from this. And I'm going to try and post some links below, and I'm gonna go drink some water now that I just talked this long. Bye guys.